Hello YouTube folks, welcome back to part 3 of Dark Souls 2. We are in the forest of fallen giants. We are doing this area over and over again because I keep fucking it up too bad. And taking too much damage. And then I get disappointed in myself and decide to, decide to retry. But this time... Things will be different. I get the feeling I'm probably going to say that a lot on this playthrough, as I do on many of my playthroughs. But this one in particular, once we get up to some harder parts of the game, especially once we get up to the parts of the game that I haven't seen yet, there will be blood, and a lot of it will be mine. But nonetheless, as long as I can murder all these dudes, I'm happy. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna go and take out this archer jerk first this time. I think that's gonna end pretty well for me. Alright, come at me, bro. There we go. And uh, just to be safe, I'm also gonna take out Axe Bro here before moving on up in the world. Just for safety. Alright. Good. That went adequately well. Let us move on and advance in our wonderful journey. Uh, there's going to be several dudes up here, but don't worry. I have a strategy. I am leaving. My strategy is, of course, cowardice. The most manly strategy ever employed. Hey, stop that. Whoa! Easy there, buddy. Settle down. Alright. Careful. Careful, TDC. Don't want to get completely wrecked. Alright. Styled all over those dudes. I feel pretty good about how that went down. Not, you know, completely flawlessly, but pretty well. Uh, we're gonna have a jerk up there with a ranged weapon. No, I don't want to target him. Yeah, so that guy's gonna just be plinking at me with arrows. I'm actually gonna go kill him. I'm not really in the mood to deal with his shit today. I'm gonna go ahead and pop one of these life gems. Just for safety. I haven't died yet. I'd like to continue my not dead streak. Oh man, there's actually, there's an item over there, but if I fuck it up, I'll fall, and I think that fall will kill me, so I'm a little bit scared. Uh, if I recall correctly, that's a pretty tough jump. Like, you can make it, but, no, not climb down, I wanted to read the message. But yeah, I think it's a pretty tough jump. Enemy ahead, thanks guy. Now I'll be ready. Scimitar is not the right weapon here. You want to notice I'm hitting the walls? Hitting the walls is actually pretty bad. Uh, much like in real life, you don't really want to hit a stone wall with your sword. It's That's not going to help you out too much with your life goals of killing people. At least, well, I mean, I know that's my life goal. I hope it's your guys' life goals, too. I notice I'm still getting hurt a fair bit through the shield. It's a really crappy shield. I'm going to have to get a better one as soon as possible. Thanks, bro. Let's jump across here. Get this item. Hurrah for treasure indeed. Another short sword. Well, that's nice. Okay, so now that I've wrecked... Hey... I never noticed that before. How do I get up there? Oh, here we go. I think I missed this item on my first playthrough. I don't think I happened to see this dude. That's uh, just a soul. Nothing wrong with souls, but it's easily not the most exciting thing on the planet. Well, I mean, souls. Actually, I don't know. They're pretty cool. Uh, d d d I'm trying to remember what that guy actually has on his corpse because I don't really want to get wrecked. I think I think if I hit this, I think I'll be okay. No! 
<laughs> wow. I'm pretty pro. I'm pretty, pretty pro at jumping. Came at the wrong angle there, hit the little rock. Completely died. Son of a bitch. That's fine. That's fine. I'm just going to have to murder everyone again. Good thing about doing those backstabs and uh, counterattacks is you're invincible while you're doing it. Bad thing is, a lot of times you can't roll in time after the animation ends to actually avoid getting hit. That didn't go super well. Ah, fuck it, I'm just gonna pop a flask. I'm, it should be fine with... Should be fine for this section with just one more flask. As long as I don't screw it up again. You know, this dual wielding thing's actually pretty alright. I mean... I'll probably get a use my shield more when I have a better shield, but still. Yeah, the whole dual wielding thing, it didn't work very well in Dark Souls 1. Um, oh yeah, you'll notice I'm now a zombie. Wow, the zombie skin looks a, like the, it looks really messed up, in my opinion, on PS3, like the way you look when you're, when you're a Zambo. That's a lot better, that looks pretty cool. Anyway, I got this helmet, which is technically better. It's a little bit heavier, but I'm gonna wear it anyway. Oh man, that's cool. I look, I look cool. Actually, that's really dope. Uh, let me just check. I'm pretty sure these are all worse, but yeah, yeah. These imported, those that imported armor set is pretty crappy. I look really dope though now. Like I, I'm like a conquistador. I like, I like being a conquistador. I'm gonna go and try that jump again. See if I can reclaim my lost honor that I lost when I fucked that up so bad. Let's try a little bit different strategy for this fight this time. This strategy is the strategy where I get wrecked. Always good to use a strategy that results in your own death. Alright. It's okay, I got this. It. As long as I don't get hit by an arrow now, everything's fine. This dude right here, if you're wondering, I could kill him. I think he drops like a sword. I don't really, I don't actually remember. Um, but I could also just leave him be. He's, he's happy. He's my friend. He got hit by a lot of arrows. You'll notice he has like arrows all stuck through his helmet. Ow! Now I have an arrow stuck through my shoulder. I feel kind of bad for the dude. I don't see any real reason to kill him. I mean, aside from looting his corpse, which is usually all the motivation you really need in an RPG, but I, I don't know, man. Sometimes you don't need to loot corpses. Let's reclaim my lost souls. Okay, let's try this again here. See if I can avoid... Shit. So you see there, like, it, you can make it. It's just... It's really, it's a really tough jump. Um, raisin toast. Oh man, I'm Joey. I'm actually pretty hungry. I haven't eaten anything today at all. I drank coffee when I woke up, which is, I normally just have coffee for breakfast and then don't eat anything until dinner. Um... But, you know, it tends to work out pretty good for me. I'm a little bit hungry, so I may get some toast. I think, I think I'm actually only hungry because you mentioned you had raisin toast, but... These things happen. Please do not shoot me with your bow. Hit. Whoa, whoa, easy there, killers. 
Man, I have to say, this is much nicer than playing on PS3, especially like when you roll on PS3. Like, for some reason, every time you roll on PS3, I guess the it can't quite handle the motion blur, and you actually get frame little frame drops when you roll. Or like, I, I don't know, like everything, it doesn't look smooth or something. It's just not nice. The PC version. Yeah, this is pretty dope. This is actually pretty, pretty sweet. Do, 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 Avoiding getting stabbed is my life's work. Yeah, there we go. That went well. Dodging all of it. Dodging everything. Let's retrieve. Okay. We've so far died twice trying to make this jump. And it's now all about honor. Yes, yes, that look okay, there we go. I did it! I did it! Hurrah for jumping! It's always good to see people having the same experience you did. And what do we get? Ten throwing knives and a soul of a nameless soldier. I'm actually going to equip those throwing knives though, that might come in handy later on. Alright. Not getting wrecked is very good. Very good. I'm gonna go ahead and pop a life gem here. You know what, since I can't actually remember what you get from murdering this dude really horribly, I'm going to do the safe thing and murder him really horribly. But this is kind of a tough fight, so there's a pretty good chance I'm gonna get wrecked. You'll notice I didn't stagger him. When I hit him, he attacks quickly. He's gonna do little combo things some of the time. Here we go. Now I got a chance. No! <laughs> Dodging. Good. See if I can get behind him so I can pull off a backstab attack. This guy can be kind of tricky. Whoa. Yeah, when he does that hyping thing, you gotta be careful. No! Not the Bowman! I don't wanna die like that. That's for damn sure. I'm gonna get a chance to drink my flask. Roll, my son! Okay, okay, it's alright, I got this. <laughs> yeah, my shield's not doing me any good here. Let's dual wield him. The good thing about this is my short sword in the offhand is a little bit faster of an attack. So, if I only got a small window, I can hit him with the short sword. Whoa! Don't be doing that. No! Okay, he's almost dead. Now I just get it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's how we perform the battling. And we get a sword. Alright. We just stand behind this tree where the archer can't shoot me and check out the sword I just found. So, where is it? Uh, so, wow. Nice. It has, uh, we'd have less... You know, physical damage, but it's got lightning damage on it, which is pretty cool. I don't have enough strength to use it effectively, though. So I'm not going to be using that just yet, but I may use that. Yeah, I know I don't have enough strength. I may use that, but later. What's the attack pattern like? Yeah, I may upgrade my strength in a little bit so I can use that. Uh, I might go back and rest before I press on to the next zone, because I'm on pretty low health, I've only got one flask left. Yeah, I'm gonna go back and rest at the bonfire again. Then we'll come through here another time and advance to the next zone. Oop. Kinda sucks dying on those jumps that many times. I was hoping to maintain my humanity for a little bit longer, but I don't really need it in this area, so it's not that big of a deal. Uh, you know, I've got 6,000 souls. I'm actually gonna head back to Majula. I'm gonna boost up my strength a bit because nine strength, I think, is what I have now. It's pretty crappy. It's not enough for a lot of weapons. So, hey girl, Emerald Harold, will you be my girlfriend? 
Guys, I don't think she's gonna be my girlfriend. Seek soul. Seek lest this Oh well. I'll get over it someday. Uh so wow, only four vigor, eight endurance. Yeah, so you got high dexterity with this character to start with, but Everything else is kind of crappy. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, bolster our strength. Up to 11. I'm going to keep the other 4,000 souls for the moment because I think I might want to buy something from Dude Bro. There's, there's a couple Dude Bros here who sell things, and I may be able to buy a considerably less crappy shield. Uh, so we now have the option... Of using the question is okay, so my damage here is going to be 115 plus 38 physical, so uh, what 155 roughly with this thing, it'll be 50 ish, 60. Yeah, so this is actually going to be a little bit better damage than the scimitar, despite me not having a great stat boost for um. The electricity, this thing is actually gonna have a bit better damage. What's the attack like? Yeah! Yeah, we're gonna use that. Uh, I could swap out my short sword plus one for the scimitar, but I kinda like having the fast attack on that short sword, so. In fact, I might actually put a dagger on there. So I can... Yeah, I might stick with that, just for the, the additional flexibility of having a much, much... Like, the dagger doesn't do a whole lot of damage, but it's nice having a very fast attack on that offhand. But if this guy can sell me the shield I want, I might just, you know, use a shield anyway. Welcome to my shop. I'm Morlin. Hi, Morlin. Uh, well, I sell armor. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. Will do, bro. I could really use the business. If you'd be so kind. No problem, dude. Just check out my flapping... dick cloth. Why... Why is it so windy inside your hat? Oh. Yeah, I guess that'd do it. All right. Yes, good. I, that's what I thought. I could buy a much, much nicer shield from this guy. Uh, yeah, this. I actually ended up using a great shield for most of my first playthrough. Um, they're really slow and they're really heavy, but they do offer really nice defense, so that's good. Uh, I'm not going to worry about upgrading my actual armor. I'm pretty happy with the Wanderer set for the moment, uh, but I might, I might actually drop. 1500 souls on getting a like a decent shield because uh, this thing's are yeah you know what I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it the shield I could just like find a shield and not Thanks waste my much. souls but I don't really I don't really give a fuck I'm not gonna have too much of a problem with shortage of souls or anything like that yeah there we go that's much better I'm not so good with the whole parrying thing, but uh, it's really nice to be able to block, particularly when there's, you know, archers. I mean, in melee combat, most of the time I'll try and dodge anyway, because even if you get hit on the shield, some damage goes through, except for with a few shields, and it does drain your stamina, but... Bearer of the curse. Seek, seek, lest... Nice to have a shield that actually does help you a little bit. And I'm going to level up a little bit more, because why the fuck not? Question is what? I think I'll be able to level up two more times? Yeah, so... Uh, you know, I'm not really feeling... Like, I think I've... I'm not really feeling like I actually need anything else at the moment, so I may just save my souls. Uh, I probably won't be, like, losing them permanently anytime particularly soon, because I know the game... Like, having said that, I'm now sure to die twice in a row without recovering my souls, but... Now that... 
probably won't happen immediately, so I'm just going to keep those for now. There's no reason in this game necessary to, to like, level up as often as you can, as fast as you can and stuff. If you don't want to, that's fine. I mean, it helps you a lot if you have a higher soul level, but despite being, you know, an RPG, this game is mostly about actually playing well, not so much about just raw stats. Oh man, that hits guys behind me on the backswing. That's pretty cool, actually. I didn't, uh, I didn't use this sword my first time through the game. I like it though. All I had to do was straight up murder that random dude who was sitting there to get it. What's the durability like? Seventy. That's that's fine. Sweet. Fucking up my parry timings. Getting shot in the face. Getting shot in the face is actually something I do in pretty much all my playthroughs now that I think about it. It's not always by a bow, so I guess that's different. Alright. That didn't go super well, but didn't go super badly. Let's continue on our journey. It's actually fine. And stream's still lagging a little bit. I don't know what the deal is with my internet today. It's just on the fritz, which is annoying. Because I'm, I mean, I'm probably going to be streaming this all day regardless, just because I really, really like this game. But I've had to cut the quality of the stream, and it's still kind of glitching out. I'm, I'm not too happy about that. Write my ISP an angry message. Tell them they owe me YouTube bucks. Not that I, you know, get any money from streaming or my YouTube videos anymore, really. I mean, I used to occasionally. But... Still, the ISPs don't know that. I guess they probably do, because they... More of my traffic. Anyway. Oh, no, I should, I should write up that message. Guy said fine work. Thank you, bro. Okay. Let's move on with our life. Hey bro, what's up? Are you having a good day? I'm having a pretty good day. I'm playing some Dark Souls, you know, it's fun. What about, what about... I'm gonna wreck your shit now. Yeah, I already knew you had a friend. That did not go super well. Do I have a thrust attack with this sword? No. So if I want to thrust, I can pull out my dagger. My dagger can thrust. And I may need a thrust up here because I think there's kind of a narrow hallway. Get out of my way! I'm just trying to remember what's actually in this next hole because I don't really want to. Yeah, so you're here. That's eh, wide enough to attack with my sword. And then, yeah, there's a bad dude down there. This guy is pretty strong, if I recall correctly. I'm thinking about trying to parry him, but I think if I fuck up my parry, he may just straight up kill me. I don't really want to die. But I gotta get this parry timing down if I'm gonna be using these smaller shields. Because, I mean, it's kinda... Or I can do that. That works. <laughs> uh, man, attacks that take that long to wind up are just probably not the most efficient method of combat when a dude with a little knife can just stab you in the face, or in that case the chest, but whatever. Uh, so let's see, dude bro there is gonna throw shit at me. This guy's got the bow of justice. He's gotta roll. I'd rather not explode, so I'm just trying to keep an eye on the guy throwing the firebombs. May come as a shock, but yeah, I'm actually not really a fan of detonating. Get erect, my son. You! Let us do battle! Wow. That really all you got? Uh, buckler. I cannot remember what this shield is like. I think the, the shield, you know, you can probably tell by the size, doesn't have a whole lot of stability or damage reduction, but I think the parry's really good on this shield. I can't quite... 
Fuck it. I keep using this thing that actually does have decent damage reduction. Uh, may come as a shock, but I like my shield to actually block damage. Let's go grab this item. Hey, bro, how's it going? How's it going, bro? I'll not be dealing with your shit today. Oh. Okay. My initial plan of getting behind him and then backstabbing him doesn't seem to be working out too good, so... Just gonna lure him out here, there's a little bit more room. And I'm gonna die now. This guy's got, he's just dialing on me too hard. What a waste of good throwing knives, I feel kind of bad about that. Don't want to be wasting your resources like that, bros, but... Well, I'm not dead, I guess is the main thing. I remember on the PS3 version, I came in here and the resolution was so low, I looked over at that dude sitting over there and I was like, what the fuck is that? Is that just like a tree stump with a lamp on it? On the PC version, I can clearly see it's a guy. I don't know, maybe I'm just somewhat blind. Oh, by guy, I of course mean woman, but like, whatever, same thing. It's, it's a female guy that... Guy is gender neutral. If, if I'm the one who's saying it. I can't remember if this woman actually has anything I want. Uh, oh yeah, that's right, the key. I need this key to open the blacksmith shop back in the uh, main town. And yeah, she does still look like uh, throwing weapons and stuff, so... You can develop a playstyle where you use a lot of throwing weapons, and this way you'll sell them to you. Uh, I could buy some humanities, but I don't need it. I do eventually want to learn heal. It's just a useful thing to have. I could buy it from her. I need to upgrade my faith a fair bit to actually be able to cast it, but I think I already have the Catalyst. Because, yeah, it is nice to be able to do a little bit of magic. I'm not going to be basing my playstyle around magic, but it's nice to nice to have a little bit. And heal is just kind of useful, so if you run out of Astus Flasks or whatever, you have, um... You have another way. Yeah, you know, I'm not going to need the souls for anything else immediately, so I'll get that. Kind of a waste, because there are a lot of places in the game to find heal, but... Well, capital anyway, I think, but don't matter. I'm not I'm not striving for some kind of perfect playthrough here. I'm just striving to not get wrecked too bad. Well, I sure wrecked that door. I'm pretty sure there's an enemy in here somewhere. I feel like there's going to be a bad dude attacking me from Yeah, you. Hey, jerk. Stop pretending to be dead, you're not fooling anyone. Certainly not fooling me. Now he's dead for real. Uh, I think that, I think the, the small wither shield is actually a pretty good shield. No, no, it's the other leather shield that's a pretty good shield. Be wary of enemy behind. I already killed him, but thanks anyway, bro. Uh, yeah, so if I fall down in the right spot, there's an item I can get it. I can't remember what this actually is. But I'm gonna get it anyway. Right, a divine blessing. Good old divine blessings. Pretty good healing item. I wonder why this statue has all this blood on it. I guess she was just having a bad day. Uh, I gotta end the YouTube part. I gotta, I gotta do that. I keep letting these things run a little bit too long because I'm not paying attention enough.